Hello, my love. Welcome back to the Arouse Podcast for another episode. I am your host, Sam, and today I'm bringing you something spiritual. I haven't really talked about meditation on the podcast, but today is the first episode that I'm going to talk to you about meditation. And if you have followed me in the past, you know, I have talked about meditation quite a bit before, but today I'm talking about which crystals are good for meditation if you are looking to start your own spiritual practice and get a little help from today's episode. So let's dive right in. Warning, the following presentation is intended for mature audiences. It includes stigma topics like sex, addictions, mental illness, adult dialogue, and strong language. Viewer discretion is advised. Meditation takes time and practice to master. And I'm going to give you a little bit of a heads up that it's going to feel a little awkward at first if you've never done it before. I felt this way when I first started. And there are so many different types of meditating. And I'm not going to go into that today. That'll be another episode. But the main goal of meditation is often to clear your mind. You know, you have a bunch of shit going on in your life and maybe you feel stressed out or overwhelmed and you're looking for something to help you ease from your anxiety, your depression, or stress from work, life, relationships, kids, whatever it is. Especially for people that have anxiety or depression like myself, it is very difficult to clear your mind. And if you have ADHD on top of that, holy shit, is it a struggle. I recently got diagnosed with ADHD as an adult, realizing that I have a hyper active mind has brought me so much peace and awareness in the fact of why meditation was so hard for me in the first place as well, because my mind was jumping everywhere. But I'm here to tell you that that's okay. So there's going to be running thoughts that are going to interrupt your ability to meditate, but that's okay. If you have ADHD, if you have anxiety or depression, using crystals in your meditation practice can help channel those thoughts through the crystal. And by releasing your thoughts, this helps to clear your mind. Crystals can be used by beginners and experienced meditators to hold the intention for your meditation. If you're skeptical, I'm going to talk about why it's important to use crystals in meditation. So it can act as a visual aid to help clear your mind or even hold an intention for your meditation. And you can focus your energy, your thoughts on the crystal that you're holding, which is going to help you clear your mind. If you think back to when you were a child, if you had a stuffed animal that made you feel better or made you feel less upset, crystal is going to work in a really similar way. When you experience your anxiety running through you, it can be really hard to keep your mind from focusing on those things that are making you feel anxious. And by holding a crystal during your meditation practice, this can help channel your running thoughts into the crystal, which then helps you release it. And this physical object that's the crystal is going to be able to offer you comfort and actually a unique vibration to you. So now I'm going to tell you which crystals can help you in meditation. Number one of three is white quartz. So this one holds a unique vibration differing from other crystals that are widely used in a variety of healing work and the clearer the crystal, the more it can help with a master healing vibration. If you have held a white quartz crystal before, you're going to notice that some are more cloudy than others because each crystal is unique unique in itself and not all of them are going to be clear and transparent as another one. And white quartz crystals are often very pure in energy and are able to find energy blockages. So by using them in meditation, you can find that channeling thoughts to them will also help in releasing those thoughts from your mind. Once you channel the negative or running thoughts from your mind, you are able to think more clearly and are better able to clear your mind in meditation. Number two is selenite. I actually have, I think, at least two selenite crystals in my house because I just love them so much. But selenite is a naturally calming vibration, which also helps in releasing negative and running thoughts from the mind. So one thing that is different 
different from selenite is that it carries a protective energy that keeps other people's energy from affecting yours. So this can also be helpful if you're overcoming from comparing yourself to others or overcoming other people's opinions becoming your own. Its energy can act as a barrier to keep other people's energy out of your space. Most people who experience anxiety and depression find themselves thinking of the past or future events that of that involve other people. Um, guilty. I do that all the time. And by using selenite, this crystal helps to release these thoughts to focus on the present, which is so important. Number three is blue agate. So blue agate is a natural healing stone that helps to calm the mind and emotions. The stone's pale blue color and smooth ripples in the appearance gives the impression of water, which is part of the reason why the stone is recommended for meditation. It is helpful during meditation to provide enough calmness to the individual to focus on clearing their thoughts. It can also provide a relaxing th- feeling. It is known to help relieve a person experiencing anxiety and depression temporarily for them to practice meditation. So there you have it. Three crystals that can help you in meditation. I can guarantee there is a crystal shop near you if you live in a city especially, or if you live in a small town, you can order one or two online from a store. These crystals aren't very expensive, and especially if you get smaller versions, they can be about one to three dollars a piece. So you can get all three of them and try them out and see which one works best for you. Or if you have a little bit more experience in crystals and you know which one that you like better, it vibes with you more, then totally stick to that one. But those are three crystals that can help you in meditation, especially if you experience from anxiety, depression, ADHD, to help focus your thoughts and enjoy your meditation so you can reduce your stress and start to be able to focus on what really matters in the present moment. Start to enjoy your life again because you deserve it. Don't forget that the breakup series is coming on July 9th to July 15th, which is this coming Friday. Make sure you are getting all the notifications from whether it's YouTube, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Stitcher, Google Podcasts, wherever you're listening to this, make sure you are signed up for each notification so you don't miss an episode. I love you so much and I will see you next time. Hey love, if you love this episode, please share it with someone that you know or take a screenshot of this episode and share it on social media, whether it's on Facebook or Instagram, tag me, The Soulful Body Co. I love you so much and I will see you in the next episode.